ito, um, kahit na uh, may baby ako at breastfeed pa, healthy, thanks God, um, meron akong sinasahod worth 10,000 per cut-off na sabi na natin, yes, nagigat ko dati sa BPO or hindi ko nga mag-get to eh. Kasi before, I, earn, I am only earning 8,000, 7,000 nung nasa BPO pa ako. Tapos, nag- um, boarding house pa ako. And then, meron pa akong lunch. Um, kailangan meron pa akong pampamasahe and whatsoever. So, I think um, yung sinasahod ko sa home base is enough, fair enough para mabuhay kami or para mabili namin yung mga necessities namin. Please, considering subscribing, hit the button red button subscribe and also beside that is the bell so that you will be also notified every time that we're updating or uploading a new video so that's it so this video is i will show you kung magkano nga ba ang sinasahod ng isang esl teacher sa 15 days cut off yes This is teacher Abby and I am a teacher in Arkansas. If you're new to this channel, you can click the subscribe button, the red button, subscribe, and click the notification button too for you to be notified always in our new videos. And you can also give this video a thumbs up if this video is interesting and very helpful for you too. So, sa isang buwan po ay sasahod ang isang ESL teacher ng twice. So, every 16th and 1st of the month. Alright, so, ang basihan po dito or ang labanan po dito ay eh, um, our, uh, how to say, hourly rate. <laughs> okay, so, ang basihan po ay our, hourly rate. Hourly. <laughs> okay, so, whatever. Alright, so, yep, hourly rate po ang basihan dito. Like, for example, you worked 5 hours a day and your hourly rate is 5 or 100 peso. So, you will definitely get a 500 peso for that day. And hindi pa kasali dun yung bonus. Like, for example, completion bonus. Kung sa 5 hours na um, schedule mo, sa, kasi ang isang oras, may dalawang student kasi each student or each class is 25 minutes. So, 25 minute na lesson and then 5 minutes break. So, it is 30 minutes. So, 30 minutes times 2 is equivalent to 60 minutes. So, it is equivalent to 1 hour. So, sa isang oras po ay meron kang 2 classes at sa limang oras meron kang 10 klase. So, sa, kung sa 10 or kung sa limang klase mo, ay lahat doon ay book or fully book ka. Walang absent, no cancelled by student, at no cancelled by teacher. You will get a definitely, ta-da! 20% of your, um, 20% ng araw mo. Kung magano yung araw mo, or kung magano yung speldohin mo for that day, ay makakakuha ka pa ng 20% percent on top of that but you can only get that after a week but it's okay kasi ibibigay nila yun it is um, a completion bonus na sinasabi nila okay so nag start ako sa akad so yung rate ko is mababa kasi wala pa akong experience at hindi naman ako ganun kagaling mag english ang rate ko noon when I started was 95 pesos and then, nag-increase na lang ako kasi na-hit na, na ko na yung target nilang teaching points. Which is, from zero, I get the 75 teaching points na mahirap para sa akin i-get. Kasi, I started here in Akadsok. Um, pregnant ako. March. Well, actually, one year na ako here in Akadsok. So, March 26, ako na nag-start ng klase. So, magwa one year na. Okay. So, 
para sa akin napakahirap kunin ang teaching points kasi um this one I'll show you or I'll explain to I'll explain to you why kung bakit mahirap or napakahirap kasi po naman kunwari makakomplete ka ng isang klase um point 2 lang ang points mo so napakahirap kunin ang one point guys so completed classes is point zero point 2 lang po Completed classes, weekend class is 0.3. So, 0.1 lang pinagkaiba nila sa normal or sa weekdays. At sa weekend naman, eh, 0.3. So, napakahirap talagang kunin. Um, here, dito kami bumabawi para mahit namin yung target. Para makapag-increase na kami ng sahod sa 5-star rating ng mga student. So, hingi ka ng 5-star sa mga student mo after class. Like, for example, um, do you like Teacher Avi? Okay, wow, very good, thank you. So, if you love Teacher Avi, you can give her a 5-star for a gift. Or, um, yeah, you can give her a 5-star. Um, or, I'm saying this, wishing Xing helping. Um, it is a way of saying that you can give Teacher Avi a 5-star rating. <laughs> Alright, so wishing Xing helping. So, alright. So, when ko na get ang 75, 75 um, teaching points, um, 11 months na ako, uh, 10 months, 10 months, when, when now I um, reach 10 months in Akon. So, napakahira po kasi, 2 months akong nag-leave kasi nanganak ako nung June. And then, I need to leave or I need to um, ask for... Um, a leave for two months. So, nag-ask ako ng leave um, nung start na ng June kasi kabuwanan ko na ng June. So, from June 1st, wala na akong class. And then, June, July, August na ako nag-start. August 16 nata. So, mga more than two months na pahinga. And then, after that, nag-teach ako um, August, September, October, hindi na naman. So, on and off yung pagtiteach ko. Bakit? Kasi may mga ginagawa ako. Kasi like, for example, nung November, ipinyag ng baby ko. So, napakahirap. Kung, kasi may preparation guy. Ako gumawa ng invitations and so on and forth. So, napakahirap kung you know, uh, magkaklasya ako. Kasi baka absent ko lang. So, penalty ko pa. Alright, so on and off yung pagtuturo ko. That's why I think na napakahirap kong kunin yung 750 teaching points. But some to those teachers, they can only get that teaching point for 2 months, 3 months. Uh, they can get that teaching points again. And then they can ask for an increase immediately to their supervisor. But I'm not really sure kung ibibigay ba ang 10 pesos. Well, actually, 10 pesos or 5 pesos or sometimes 2 or 3. But it's okay. Ma malaking bagay na rin yun, di ba? Mga teachers. Okay. Okay, so... Mapapansin you guys, nagpalit ako ng damit kasi nag-shower po ako and katatapos lang po ng aking 8.5 hours na shift. So, yes. Hi, nakakapagod. But it is all really worth it. Um, sa sa 8.5 hours kung shift na yun, meron ako 17, 17 classes. Fully booked po ako for this day. And nakakapagod o po. So, yun na nga po. Let's continue um, sharing the salary that I earned here in Akitsok. So, ang ipapakita ko po sa inyong payment or salary ko is, um, alright, so sabihin na lang natin, ito, um, way back February 16. So, nag-earn ako ng 10,630 pesos and 50 cents. Kasi, I worked, um, 101 hours for that cut off. And kasama na po yung completion, completion, 
inflation bonus. Kasama na po dyan yung bonus na worth 1,235. Kasi, for example, 20%. 20% is like, for example, na book ka for that whole day without absent, without cancel by student. So, you will get that 20%. Pag may absent ka, isa, dalawa, um, 10% or 75% ng class mo for that day makakakuha ka ng 10% sa sinawad mo that day. Okay, so I'll show you a video. Um, I will show you a video of kung magkano or I will show you a picture kung magkano nga ba ang sinawad ko for that day or for that cut off. Okay, so here it is. Yes, guys, um, you are only working from home and nakakasama mo yung anak mo, yung husband mo, and hindi mo na kailangan mag sa traffic kung may pera ka ba o wala kasi yung kailangan mo naman is internet at kuryente, laptop. So, makakapasok ka, makakapagklase ka kahit na wala kang pera. As long na meron ka nung tatlong kailangan. Laptop, internet, at kuryente, or ilaw. So, yun po. So, na-share ko na yung kung magkano man ang aking sinahod. So, yun yung husband ko is nag-decide din siyang um, pumasok sa home base. Well, he, had, he has an experience for three years sa T-Mobile. Tama ba? T-Mobile? Hindi ko na niya pronounce yung word na yun. Um, T-Mobile. Um, although we know na nagigat sila ng um, bonus kung nagigat nila yung target. However, toxic kasi yung account na yun eh. So, I decided or I asked him kung gusto niya yung pumasok sa home base. Well, yes, he tried it and then actually he's enjoying it. So, kaming dalawa na po ay nagpo home base and yep, Kinakaya. <laughs> Alright, so thank you so much for, you know, um, watching this video. And please considering subscribing, hit the button, red button, subscribe. And also beside that is the bell so that you will be also notified every time that we're updating or uploading a new video. So that's it. Thank you so much, and this is Teacher Abby saying goodbye. See you again next time. Bye.